GA Spoilers tease two weeks of non-stop action in Port Charles. General Hospital spoilers reveal two weeks that will feel like old home week in PC with familiar faces and familiar stories, as well as plenty of angst and romance. There's never a dull moment in the key house when Tracy, Jane Elliott, decides to pay a visit, and this time she is back for an extended stay. Will she know more about what Victor, Charles Shaughnessy, can get from the Ice Princess necklace, and more about what really happened to Luke, Tommy Jerry? Perhaps she can now help wrap this story up. Spencer, Nicholas Alexander Chavez, sure wants to help put an end to Victor's treachery, and he has Trina, Tabian Ali, along with him for the ride on the Haunted Star. However, he needs to take care of his baby brother Ace and make sure Victor doesn't get a chance to raise him and corrupt him. Hopefully, he has some ideas on how to deal with colic. Ninas, Cynthia Watros. Life is also affected by Victor's descent into pure madness because Willow's Caitlin McMullen survival depends on finding him and therefore finding Aunt Liesel, Kathleen Gaddy. But first, she has to wonder if she will be invited to Willow's latest deathbed wedding. Holly Sutton, Emma Sams, reunites with an old friend. Felicia finds who she's been looking for Chase, Josh Swickard, voices his gratitude. Brooke Lynn, Amanda Sutton, is ready to speak up for him. Robert, Tristan Rogers, berates Sonny, Maurice Bernard. How dare he have Diane, Carolyn Hennessy, as his lawyer. Carly, Laura Wright, and Jocelyn, Eden McCoy, offer their help. Time to plan another wedding. Alexis, Nancy Lee Gran, receives a touching offer. What does Gregory, Gregory Harrison, have in mind? Chase learns his fate. Will he get to be a cop again? Holly is in danger. Isn't Holly's life always in danger? Willow makes a momentous request. When you have two weeks to live for the last six months, every request is momentous. Alexis is shaken. Does she learn what is really wrong with Gregory? Which means we get to learn it too? Tracy Quartermain returns. Let the games begin in the Quartermain house. Curtis, Donald Turner, has a light bulb moment. Good for him. Does she figure out where Victor is headed? Victor learns of a setback. Never kidnap a baby, or there will be setbacks. Nina seeks solace. All she can do is worry about poor, dying Willow. Ava, Mora West, gives Carly food for thought. Does she try to teach the unself-aware woman about forgiveness? Elizabeth, Rebecca Herbst, compliments Austin, Roger Howarth. Will they be unmasked and recognize each other from another life? Victor has bad news for Spencer. Oh, things are not going quite as planned. Curtis seeks help from Drew, Cameron Matheson. Isn't Drew already supposed to be helping bring down Victor? Ava and Portia, Brooke Care, connect. They are both worried sick about Trina. Carly tries to make peace. Will Michael, Chad Duell, even allow it Ned, Wally Kurth, vents to Brooke Lynn. His mother is driving him crazy. Drew and Curtis confer with Laura, Jenny Francis. She knows more about the Ice Princess than they do. Sammy surprises Dante, Dominic Zampradna. Does he try to do something the legal way? Gladys, Bonnie Burrows, Badmouths Cotty, Josh Kelly. She needs to make sure he goes to jail. Molly, Haley Pullos, gets unexpected news. Does she learn she may have trouble becoming a mom? Sasha offers encouragement. She is there for her friend Willow. Curtis, Drew, and Laura share their findings. Do they share them with Jordan, Tanisha Harper, and make her happy? Carly says goodbye. That does not sound good for Carly's life. Ned is preoccupied. Tracy has given him a lot to think about. Olivia, Lisa Lo Cicero, and Brooke Lynn, Amanda Seton, are amazed. Is Tracy giving them trouble? Two, Felicia, Christina Wagner, is concerned. This mission is not working out quite as planned. Robert and Diane are interrupted. Are these two becoming a little too friendly? Alexis shares a message. Will she become involved with her own family story? Sonny has mixed feelings. Should he go through with the Pikeman deal? Willow gets bad news. Does she have only one day left, which really means three months? Or do the peonies not arrive on time? Nina puts on a happy face. Willow is getting married. Will she be at her own daughter's wedding? Chase and Dante offer support. 
Perhaps they are partners again at the PCPD. Carly hides her worry. Insider trading? Willow dying? Which worry is it today? Holly shares what she's learned. Does she have a lot of information that can help E. Victor relishes his triumph? He's located his pathogen. Willow prepares to walk down the aisle. Will she make it or will this wedding really be on her deathbed? It's Michael and Willow's wedding day. Finally, tomorrow took an entire two weeks. Amazing. Ava doesn't mince words. She never does. So why should she start now? Dan plays peacemaker. Is this a Sonny and Michael problem? Mina makes a big move. Will Willow accept this big move or be cold and distant as she often is? Brooke, Lynn, and Ned navigate some tricky dynamics. Tracy has made their lives a whole lot more difficult. Michael makes an accusation, as he always does, and he is usually wrong. Dex, even Hofer, must be discreet. He can't let Sonny know what he is really up to. Sonny offers assistance. He is ready to help anyone who needs it, except for his enemies. Holly makes a startling discovery. Does she finally come across her son Ethan, Nathan Parsons, or is it someone else? Victor has unwelcome guests, who found his little three-hour tour party. General Hospital airs weekdays on ABC. For more about what's coming up in Port Charles, check out all the latest that's been posted on GA Spoilers, and for an in-depth look at the show's history, click here. The best place for true soap fans to be is our Facebook groups. Have you joined? If you love soap spoilers, gossip and fans as dedicated as yourself, check out Days of Our Lives fans, General Hospital exclusive, the young and the restless fans, and the bold and the beautiful fans.